everybody, this is Geek Talk Re Games, and um, I'm going to be doing uh, Minecraft for my first Let's Play, but not normal Minecraft. As you can see, it says Minecraft Sh uh, Forge here. Let me show you the mod packs I got. I have Optifine, Coder, Mod Loader, Minecraft Forge, and Pixelmon. All right, which is Pokemon on uh, Minecraft. Uh, I'm going to be doing a single player game because I don't have access to a server, which is hopefully will change soon. Um, so let's go ahead. As you can see here, this is the uh, world that I was using to learn how to get everything done in that. Um, so we're going to create a new world. And we're going to name this world Geek Talk Games. Alright, uh, more world options, uh, won't do bonus chests, won't do uh, cheats, uh, world type, um, large biomes, we'll do default, generate structures, yes, um, and I'm going to do Johto as the seed um, we're going to go survival and create a new world so this is cool your normal screen that you see when it pops up is going to be completely different it says this is a fan made mod all trademarks and copyrights for Pokemon are owned by Nintendo and Game Freak all right, now here's our your cho uh, your starters. You have the for the original Pokemon, and then subsequent thereafter. I don't think they have the starters for Black and White yet. Um, so now my uh, first world, I used Bulbasaur, and to do that. Uh, so let's pick. You know what? We're going toward Chick. All right, and here we go. We are in the world of Pokemon Pixelmon. So let me check something here. All right, let's go this way. Now in Pixelmon, let's go ahead and get some stuff set here. Get some wood. And if all want to know what my skin looks like, I'm a Doctor Who fan. All right. Building an axe here. Because, you know, it's easier to chop down trees with an axe. So I want to go ahead and get me some wood. Oh, look at the other Pokemon. Um, all right, some things I want to show you here. Now, with this mod, if you push the R button, you call out your po Pokemon, and your Pokemon will fight you. Uh oh, looks like I'm in a battle, and it's a level 16 Laybug against my five level Torchic. Yeah, we're gonna run. And here's another one of the mods or mods for the game. It's these. Apricorn. And these are the things you use to make your Pokeballs. And once I get everything set up for that, I will show you how to do that. Alright, let's go explore a little bit. No, you stay inside. 
do not want random Pokemon saying, hey, we're going to fight you and kill you. Now, just to let you know, this is the same seed I used for my my private game. Ah, no. Not yet. Good. So, let's see if we can find some cool Pokemon. Like, right here. This is a... Oh, I can't pronounce that. It's level 12, so I don't want to mess with it. Plusle and a minus. Well, he's a level five, so let's see if we can fight him. Not the forty-six primate. Only if I was crazy, like an idiot. So let's see if we can do our first battle here. I'm not here. Okay, here we go. Got our first battle. Just growl. This is kind of fun. Especially if you're like me. I, I, I grew up on Pokemon, and this is, like, really fun. And enjoyable. Uh oh, he's paralyzed. I'm not going to give up. It's probably just gonna be me sitting here trying to fight this thing. Oh. Yeah. You know what? Since I keep getting paralyzed, let's get out of here. Ah, you know what? Since you can't move, let's try again and see what happens. Yeah, it just keeps paralyzing me. Let's get out of here. Alright. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Where's my mouse pointing? There it goes. I got like 15... My torchic alone. Now, when you do play this game, it might be a little bit hard to find um, Pokemon centers because they they are kind of hard to find. But once you find them, uh, what I recommend is if you ever do this to download this and play. Uh, make it your base. Take it over, make it your ba base. Oh, this is my first time seeing them. There's the Eevees. What level are you, Eevee? You're level 15. Get out of the water, you're gonna drown. Um... Also, keep a look for in the trees for for leaves that don't look quite white. Uh, go ahead and start, uh, you know, like have an axe or pick pickaxe to harvest those, um, because those are leaf shards. And if you get enough of them, you can combine them to form a leaf stone, 
which you can use to uh, evolve a grass type Pokemon. And there is one thing that you'll notice: you'll will you will see huge ass Pokemon. So, this is, like I said, this is just going to be the first of the Let's Plays on this. Uh, it's not going to be very long. Uh, you will find trainers along the way, and you will be able to fight them. They don't drop anything. Other things you want to keep a look, look out for is, say, like, um, like a cl uh, particles coming from the ground. Because you'll want to collect those and, like, dig around them. Don't know what that is. Because once you dig around them and find out they it's usually something cool buried. Uh, you are gonna need a lot of stone, a lot of iron to do things in this game. Because you have to build an anvil. Is that clay? Can tell if I hit it. Yes, that's clay. Um, because you you have to um, you have to build your pokeballs and all that. Whoa! Up. You have to build your pokeballs. You you can't go to a store and buy them. Uh, now, when I played this on my first level that would hurt and there was a Vulpix down um what's this no I, I really don't like to fight Pokemon just yet till I can either get to a uh a Pokemon Center, or if you find some Reaps or any evolved forms of those that have the wool, and if they've been in a battle, look around because if they've lost, they will drop wool. That's that's one of the only ways you can get the wool and build a bed. Because if you build a bed and use it, you'll be able to sleep. That's a bug type against a fire type. Let's try something. Yeah, it's going to beat me, so let's get out of here. So, yeah. And, um... I'm probably, like I said, I'm probably not going to do much today. But I do hope you enjoyed this. Um, leave a comment below if you like what you're seeing. Um... Also, something else that will happen, you'll see, like, other Pokemon be fighting each other in the distance. Uh, look around that, because sometimes the um, the ones that are beating beaten will drop loot or stuff. If this is what I think it is, I might be near a Pokemon Center. One thing I suggest is once you find a Pokemon Center, also if you ventured out, write down your coordinates. Bring up this and write down your coordinates, uh, the X, Y, and Z, because if not, you won't be able to find your way back. Um, <laughs> because I have gotten lost multiple times. And I have some coordinates written down that if this is the right seed, um, I'll be able to get to it because I have a center marked that actually has some really good stuff around it. Shoulder. Shoulder. Squirtle. Hey, look, there's a Squirtle. Shoulder. Shoulder. But on that note, I just wanted to do a quick video to, for my first YouTube games. Um, I had a battle. I've been that eh, there's spider webs and trees. One thing I also suggest is once you find these ap apricorns, um, don't 
make Pokeballs just yet. Plan them. Because they were an apple too. Riley Kate's staring at me. Because um, they're only found in forest biomes or anywhere with trees. There's some gold. And here's some lights. That means one of two things. I actually went around in circles. No! It's a level 32 against a 5. Yeah, there was no way it was going to end well. Okay, what I was talking about here... I found Toxic! That little sparkle is a... Uh, like an item or something, and I just happened to find a move. I'll show you, see, right there. That's Toxic. So I can give that to any Pokemon that can accept a Poison-type move. Which is cool. On that note, I'm actually going to go ahead and end this Let's Play. Sorry for the traffic noise. Um, in the comments below, tell me what you think. This has been Cybertron X, and this has been Geek Talk Games.